Connecting Tennis here, welcome to another video and today I decided to do something after all the questions I got after I released uh, last week the surplus one strategy, it was a PDF if you don't know what I'm talking about you can download it yet if you don't have it yet and the, the video is gonna be a uh, link in the description you can click in there, uh, download it and then you know what I'm gonna be talking about in this video and I have a lot of questions on how to make it better Okay, the, the surplus one strategy that I created Okay, it's it's, I call it like that because it's actually it works on the serve and the second ball. Okay, the surplus one, either forehand or backhand. Okay, this PDF is uh, based on the serve plus forehand. If you see on the Instagram channel, I have some uh, some videos that I put there of uh, players doing it. So I'm gonna show you now with Paulo. Okay, some drills um, for you guys to work on it. So you probably will need two people uh, because you're gonna do the motion of the serve and then I'm gonna toss the ball, you're gonna, you're gonna be able to see it now. I'm gonna toss the ball for, for Paolo to hit the ball. There are two options. You can do the actual serve, okay? Just serve the ball and then when you're following somebody, toss the ball and you have to get fast, okay? Out of the serve to hit the ball. If you don't have so many balls, okay? You don't wanna, uh, sometimes players, depending on the level, they hit the serve, but they're thinking the second ball. So they miss the serve, they do just any uh, random technique on the serve and then they're, they're thinking too much on the second ball. So. Paul is just gonna do the motion of the serve, okay? Champing and following on the left or right leg, depending if you're left or righty. And then right after that, I'm gonna toss the ball. I'm gonna do four with him, just serve and forehand with the second ball. So this is a great drill for you guys to practice it. So let's check it out. As you say there, uh, I tossed all the balls when he was falling, okay, when he was falling on the serve, okay, he does the motion. The moment he's touching the, 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 the floor, okay, the court, I'm tossing the ball, so he has to actually be pretty quick. This is gonna help you a lot in the quickness, okay? If, you, if you're not quick enough, you need to do more fitness. We have tons of videos, okay, for you to get quicker. So that's one of the drills. I'm gonna show you another one now with some uh, variations, okay, putting a cone in front of him and making him running around the cones to get faster and maybe you can do also another variation of putting cones in the other side and just aiming to places depending where you want to play the ball I just gave him the freedom to play the second ball where he wants but this is actually the best way to work the, the, the surplus one then of course you have different variations if you serve from this side if you serve from the view side if you have the inside out or inside in forehand if your opponent returns to your forehand where you play that ball so now we're gonna do it serving from the view side and he's gonna hit the forehand from that. Right, so from this side, you're gonna see, I put there, okay, I set up two cones. Imagine there is a laser line, okay, between cone and cone. I actually can't put a rope or anything so he doesn't step on it, he doesn't fall. But the, imagine there is a line between cone and cone. What I'm gonna do here, and this works a lot more on quickness, that's what you need to execute a great surplus one. He's gonna serve from the due side and I'm gonna toss the ball. What he needs to do is hitting the ball before the ball crosses the line of the cones. What we do here? I am uh, putting pressure on him on serving and getting fast out of the serve to hit the ball, okay, coming into the court so he doesn't wait on the baseline for the ball. So he's not hitting actually from the baseline, he's hitting aggressive, getting into the court and looking to make damage, okay, on his opponent. So let's check it out. See there, he makes the motion of the serve, he gets fast, he actually got most of the balls, all of them before the line of the cones, but some of them really uh, forward on the court, so stepping and aggressive, you could see he changed middle, cross court and down the line, showing you there the different variations and how you can be aggressive. It's very important here to work on the serve, to have an aggressive serve and then have a return, okay, either flat, slice or kick serve have a return that is gonna allow you to come in, of course, if you if you don't have a strong serve and the return comes too fast uh, or to the angles, maybe it's gonna be hard for you to, to execute the surplus one. So very important here to have a great serve 
so you can get a return to then execute the shot. So I hope you guys, uh, I, I clean your doubts here on, on how to work, how to make the surplus one better. I hope you can work on this. Okay, if you have any question, you can leave me the comment here or on Instagram. If you follow me there, just DM me your questions and everything or leave the comment. I always try to answer everything. I hope you guys like this video. You find it helpful, share it with your friends. Uh, if you didn't subscribe to the channel, please subscribe so you stay tuned with all the content. Thank you guys and see you in the next one.